All right, so hello, my environmental science class at Ecorus High School. This is my first video lesson I'll be doing with you, and this one is like really, really simple. Um, basically, um, I'm just gonna take you through accessing your Google Classroom through your phone and what to expect to see in there. It's cool if you do it through the computer, that's fine. But it was easier for me to do it through my phone and do this video because I'm just recording my screen. So that's why you hear me, but you don't see the screen moving because I haven't touched it yet. All right, so basically what's gonna happen is every Monday, I'm gonna post three things. I'm gonna post the unit overview for the topic we'll be covering. I'll be posting the notes for that unit, for the whole entire unit, and I'll be posting all the relevant articles for that unit, okay? So kind of following the same format that I would follow if we were in normal class, and this will all be review of everything that we've covered this whole school year. So those of you who did not have me first semester, this is your opportunity to kind of get caught up and review or learn for the first time what we covered the first semester. All right, so if you notice on Monday, this past Monday, I posted uh, this post right here, right? And it has my little message to you or whatever. And then it has the space systems overview document, the space systems note document, and the articles document. So if you click on an overview document first, which would make sense to do, um, it has all the information in there once it opens. So it kind of gives you an overview of that unit, like a brief little synopsis about what that unit is, um, the topics that we'll be covering, the standards that are associated with those topics that are mandated by the state of Michigan for me to teach. If this was the regular school year, you see you have the assignments tracking list. So those would be the assignments that I would be um, giving to you. Then you have your resources, and so you can click on those resources and access different ways to learn this stuff in, a, in another way. And then lastly, you have your vocabulary that's related to the topics, so that way you can um, know what's going on. Alrighty, so then you have your notes. So once these notes open, all right, so you have notes. You don't need to know it's all oh boy. Y'all need to see what's going on in my house. There's a bunch of incidents occurring. All right, there we go. All right, so space systems. Um, so we look at the Big Bang Theory, the sun and the other stars, and then the solar system. Um, so you would go through those notes and it should have all the information relevant. Now, if you find other information that you feel is important for us to add to these notes, please put it in the comments below the post, please, all right? Or you can do it on a survey that you'll be completing every Friday. So let me go back, all right. So then lastly, we have these articles. So with these articles, you can go through the articles. This looks incomplete for whatever reason, didn't load, but I put all the articles in one document. Read them at your leisure. You don't have to read them all at one time. Um, and get, again, give me your feedback. How helpful, what helpful were these articles? Okay. Um, did you get what you needed from it? Let's go back. Let's close that out. All right. So then on Wednesdays, I'll be posting a question or some sort of activity as well as doing a video conference call um, with Zoom. And the information for you to join it will be posted every week. And I'll be doing that conference call every Wednesday from 10 a.m. to 11. Um, you just freely join. You don't have to be in there for the full hour. If you want to come kick it with me, talk to me on a deeper level about some of this stuff or just see me, say hi, or you have questions or anything that you need clarified, please feel free to join in anytime between 10 a.m. and 11 a.m. And so I'll be doing that every Wednesday, as well as posting that uh, question that I expect you to respond to or um, an activity. And then lastly, on Friday, on Fridays, I'll be posting a survey where I need your feedback on the entire unit. All right. So let me know how you felt about the unit. Did you feel like it was comprehensive enough? Did you have enough information to understand the topics? Do you have a better understanding of the standards? What could I have done better to teach you or deliver the information to you? Um, what did you like? What did you not like? All right. So that is going to kind of take the place of a quiz every Friday. All right. So let me go back again and kind of explain that to you one more time. The expectation is that you get onto the Google Classroom, right? 
Every Monday, there will be a new unit posted with the overview, the notes, and the articles for that unit. On Wednesday, I'll give you either an activity or a question that I expect you to respond to. And on Friday, it'll be a survey. All right. Those are the three things that you would have to do um, for the week and you will be graded for it. Now, the grades won't be seen here in um, this Google Classroom, but they will be uh, uploaded or whatever. Now, those of you who don't have access to the computers, right, but somehow you got this message, this information will be printed for you to be picked up at the school or whatever pickup location you'll have available for you. I know that the district has been really good about communicating with the families on how to go about doing this. So we are doing everything we can to accommodate you. So I strongly suggest those of you who were already felt getting a D or F, you need to do this work. Otherwise, you're going to keep that D or that F. And there's nothing else I can do about that. So if you have any questions, please feel free to get in contact with me. You know, you have my email address. You can hit me up through um, this Google Classroom or you can join this conference call. But there are a lot of different ways that you can get in contact with me and I'm available. So I look forward to seeing you guys next week. Um, take care.